Welcome to the Sunday Painter. Please click and subscribe, hit the like button and don't forget the little bell so you will be the first when we have an inspirational idea. Leave a happy creative comment. Hi my name is Bill. Hi my name is Sonia. Here is a beautiful picture of Marilyn Monroe. Come and paint your own Marilyn. The first step is to prep the canvas by adding gesso then sanding it down with 220 grit sandpaper, I like a smoother canvas, this also giving a tooth for putting oil paints on the surface. Starting with the big shapes. I used a blue thin by liquid medium so it will dry fast. Before it dries I start blocking in color, keeping it thin but thick enough to cover the canvas. The overall color is blue, adding gray with blue the sheet start to come alive. Each progressing layer of the paint gets a little thicker to cover the canvas. Thinking always of the big picture first while squinting your eyes, looking for only the largest shapes and color, working some brushwork to a variety of interesting textures. At this point I start looking at the roundness and shadows for all forms. Painting the whole work together will ensure me of harmony and soft blended edges. Always paint what you see, not what you know. For instance the is no color as pure white or pure black. The whites they reflect all the colors surrounding the surface. Blacks can be the darkest color of the hues also reflecting what is around. Building color so the work has a stained glass effect. Giving it a richness when different lights hit the work. In Bill's painting in style, she comes to life. Having a glow you can only get with oil paints. This work was done in six sitting with a seventh making small touch-ups. Then letting it dry properly. When completed, Varnish was apply, just two coats with a sponge brush. When applying varnish always move slow to keep the bubbles down and gives the oil its pop. Give it a try, and always, always, have fun.